Who will help this girl? She was slapped and beaten into unconsciousness. A hand reached for her shirt button and then down to take off her shoes. The man's body starts to shake. Each hit is a nightmare for the girl. Afterwards, the girl is picked up and put in a small dark room. There are countless girls who have lost their lives here. Every day they are beaten by the men in turn to give out their sexual desires. They are not treated like human beings. No food, no water, and they name this hellhole a comfort station. This is a history that should be remembered by all. Please hold your breath and see it through to the end. One morning in 1943, a Japanese army truck drove by. They took an instant liking to the young and beautiful Minnie. Soon after, they came to her house looking for trouble. The officers pushed her father away. The officers pushed her father out of the way and took Minnie away to be sent to the army. The parents fell to their knees and cried. They knew that this separation would be forever. Soon Minnie was put on a train a private room of less than 20 square meters. There were over 30 underage girls gathered. Some naively thought that they were just being sent to work in a factory. Unbeknownst to them, they were arriving at the front lines of the war, and the purpose of this group of girls were transported is from men to vent. Minnie was so good looking that she was quickly taken by the officers. Before they could have sex, they needed a full body check. She was strapped to a wooden bench. The male doctor bent down. He used scissors to cut open the hem of her skirt and roughly reached down to examine her. The result was announced as a virgin. Then she was taken to a bath, washing her body for the last time. After that, she changed into a nice long dress, waiting quietly for the devil to come. An officer comes in and scares Minnie into begging for mercy. He was like a hungry wolf hunting for food. In this dark room, there is no escape for anyone, and so Minnie is plunged into an endless nightmare. Every day. A different man comes in and out, even when she's in the middle of her period. Her body is exhausted. There was no escape from the devil's hand, screaming and crying as she fought through the pain. She was bruised and battered by the whip until she fell into a coma. With a little luck, the girls survived to go out for air, but living like that was worse than dying. You can't imagine what happened to these girls lying on the ground. A Japanese soldier stopped, gently patting the dust off the bodies. Smiling, he said to his partner, we can still use it while it's hot. Whenever these devils finished fighting, they would come to the comfort stations. Klein, open the door, throw the clothes to the girl and ask her to change. The girl fell to her knees and begged for mercy, only to be slapped. The girl was forcefully slapped. The girl was forcefully asked to put on the clothes of her dead companion. When she changed into the Chiongsum, she turned around and saw the man had already tightened his whip and smiled in disgust. The screams wake many. Every day, innumerable girls die here. But she was lucky. She met a civilized young man. He wants to help the girls here, helping many escape to her home. When she heard this, it was as if she had caught a lifeline, finally dared to shed a tear. When she went out the next day, the two met secretly. The young man handed Minnie a map and told her how to escape. But even with the help, Minnie was still hesitant because this place is heavily guarded. There are soldiers watching all the time. The last girl who planned the escape had been killed alive by the demons. But when she thought about it, staying here was worse than dying. So she decided to give it a try. She talked to the girls. She and the girls agreed to escape from the comfort zone in the dead of night. However, they failed. The officers decided to punish everyone. If they didn't like it, they punched them in the head. He grabbed them by the hair and punched them until they were knocked out. And stripped the girls naked. Showed the scars on their backs. Called them animals. They should live like dogs and never escape. I the next day, some of the girls were dressed in flowery dresses and put on buses. People throw away their envy, thinking they were liberated to go home. But that was not the truth. They were taken to a small ravine. The scene before them was desperate. There were bodies piled up and ready to be burned. Someone reacts and turns around and yells, Run! You see the soldiers on the right. These demons are ruthless. They're not even sparing their own people. This is definitely one of the saddest pieces of history. Three young girls were captured kneeling in front of the bodies of their compatriots and kicked in one by one. They were told to kneel in front of the corpses and shout insults, or else they would die with their hands on their heads. The girls intended to hold hands to comfort each other to be sisters again in the next life. With the command to shoot, a young girl should fall to the ground. The next person followed closely. The last one left, but no movement after a while. It turned out that the young soldier could not bear. Killing innocent girls like this. The next second, the officers raised his hand and shot the girl. Then without saying a word, the muzzle of the gun was aimed at the young soldier. They were brutally killed together. This is what happens when you are not ruthless. You can't imagine, given the context, the things these demons did. Each one of them was more insane than the other. They built comfort stations and took girls away. They used them as tools to get off. 
they even open their legs for research. Once they are used up, they are dead. The girl Minnie has been suffering for two years under such conditions. Finally, the day the war broke out, they were transported away in vehicles. The devil decided to take the girls. They were all shot and dumped. Looking at the hundreds of bodies of her compatriots, Minnie completely desperate, sobbing uncontrollably, and at the very moment of crisis, volunteers swarmed from the forest. The enemy was caught off guard, the demon who likes to whip girls. Finally, in the midst of the war, his blood was spilled on the ground. It was a great pleasure. The Japanese were repulsed by an overwhelming attack. At the same time, Minnie took the opportunity to escape from the battle with her girlfriends. When she got tired of running, she sat her down to rest, thinking that she was safe. Suddenly, Minnie... Suddenly, Minnie's leg was injured. She didn't expect there was a demon remnant here. He raised his gun and tried to drag the girl to hell with him. Just then Minnie stepped forward. She ran in front of her best friend. She fought off the bullets with her flesh. These are the most admirable sisters. Minnie is stronger than everyone and more eager to go home than anyone else. Her life was particularly tragic. She wrote a history with her own true story, The Girls Who Survived the War. Now the film Ghost Town is made with crowdfunding to warn the youth of today's society. Don't forget the national shame and remember history. These heavy wounds should not be forgotten.